Sign up at the end of this review to get my personal gear list. Hey there, Tony Policastro here from The Acoustic Letter. Today we're going to compare a Taylor 314 to a Taylor 114. But before we do so, let me please remind you to stick around to the end of the video and sign up for The Acoustic Letter. You'll be very happy that you did so. This is a comparison that we get asked about very frequently. What's the difference between a Taylor 314 and a 114? Well, aesthetically, there's really not much, and I think that's why we get asked. But internally, and as far as how they're made, very, very different. The Taylor 114 has a laminate sapelli back and sides, a Sitka spruce top, X bracing that is forward shifted, a standard carved mahogany neck, an inch and 11 sixteenths tusk nut and a tusk saddle, ebony bridge and an ebony fingerboard, and closed gear tuners. This is a great entry level model and comes in at a great price. The 314, instead of laminate back and sides, has solid sapelli. The top is also Sitka spruce, but it is paired with a forward shifted X bracing that is scalloped and paired with a relief route, which gets us a little bit more response out of the top. The neck on the 314 is also mahogany and has a standard carve. The fretboard and bridge are also ebony, and the saddle is tusk, but the nut width is different on the 314. The 314 has a 1 and 3 quarter inch tusk nut as opposed to the 114 which has an inch and 11 sixteenths. Another huge difference between the two is that the 114 has a full satin finish while the 314 has a gloss top and satin back and sides. The 314 also has closed gear tuners. So aesthetically, again, these guitars are very similar, but they are built so very different. So what we're gonna do is play the Taylor 314 and the 114 so you can hear the difference.
Click the link to get the world's best acoustic guitar reviews sent to your inbox. Why? Because it's free and it's the easiest way to get prices and high res photos of each guitar. Plus, as soon as you sign up, you'll get the free tabs and lessons for the songs I play in my guitar reviews. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking this button.